What's up guys, welcome back to a brand new video for today We're going to be doing like a, not a makeup tutorial But um, like a little get ready with me I'm pretty much just going to get ready with you guys And I actually want to try this new makeup thing Well I haven't done it myself But I've seen a couple people doing it um, I actually got this idea from Louis' video, which he just recently did. I will post it for you guys so you guys can see. Meeting you guys, aquí está the full look all complete. But pretty much it's like you put the tape on and then you do the eyeliner with the eyeshadow, but then you blend it. And I don't know how it's going to come out, um, but I'm going to try it. I just want to try it just to see how it I don't know, just to see how it works. Okay, let's go ahead and get started. Let me go ahead and do my brows. And how I do my brow? Okay. I guess this is a little tutorial or whatever. But the way I do my brows, I always start from the beginning. And I don't get a lot of product. I just tap it a little bit. Start from the beginning right here. Bring it up. And under right there. And then I just start to like kind of blend. Okay, now as you guys, I don't know if you guys can tell or not, but I'm not pushing my brush all the way to my skin. I'm kind of just tapping it just so that it blends out perfectly and it doesn't like, you know, you don't get too much product on your brow and make it so dark. If you guys hear any noise, it's my baby right there. He's actually asleep right now. Um, you guys might even see his little hands stretch out, but he's okay. baby. And then for my concealer to conceal my eyebrows, I'm going to be using the Bye Bye um, Under Eye Concealer. So now what I'm going to go ahead and do, I'm going to get a beauty blender and I'm just going to do that. Stick that. There you go. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and go in with my brush and brush them one more time. And I'm just going to do it like in the beginning of my eyebrows. Leave the rest of it alone. There you go. Okay, you guys, and if your eyebrows don't look the same, don't freaking put your all into the brows because you know, brows are not supposed to look the same. So, there you go. Now, we're gonna go ahead and so I got my tape, and now what I'm gonna go ahead and do, I'm gonna cut a little piece and pretty much just put it. Oh, hold on, I'm gonna for this. Oh, oh, oh. So we're going to go ahead and do the other one. Mm -hmm. Let me just make sure they're the same. Okay. So yeah, I can put some of those little tapes. I'm going to go ahead and go in with the color black. I'm going to go ahead and get that one off my Jocelyn Hill palette because my other palette does not like. Okay, so for this part, I am going to have to use a brush. So the one I'm going to be using, I'm going to be using this little one and I need a tinier one. Okay, now that I have this ready, I'm going to go ahead and I grab this little brush. Which is a, this one, a tiny one. Look, I can't fucking talk. So I'm going to go ahead and grab a dark black color. So it's going to be this one up here and this right here. So I'm going to go ahead and, and like I said, you guys, this is my first time doing this. So I don't fucking know how it's going to come out. But we're gonna hope that it comes out good. So I'm gonna try to like. Think you can really think of it. Okay, let me just try my other one. This is making me look stupid right now. Okay, I got it. So we're gonna go ahead and grab the black and pretty much.
Okay, so now that I have both eyeliners, I'm gonna go ahead and use this brush and pretty much we're just gonna bring it on the face. Now that it's all blended, we're gonna go ahead and use this orange one and I'm gonna use the same brush just so I can blend out good. So we're gonna get a little bit, just tap it a little bit. And we're just gonna make a Now that that's done, we're gonna go in with a nude color. And actually, I'm just gonna go in with white. We're gonna go in with this right here. And I'm just gonna apply with my finger. And just super light like that, okay? Now that that's done, we're gonna go ahead and take the tape off. I'm not gonna do. I'm not gonna do. <laughs> I'm not gonna do a thick eyeliner. I'm gonna do a just a thin line. Okay, we're gonna add my glue and we're just gonna wait till it dries. Give it like 10 seconds and apply it on your eyeball. Okay, so I'm gonna have to rush it a little because my baby is waking up. Or he's actually up, I think. He's wanting to wake up. So we're gonna go ahead and add mascara just so that my lashes can stick to the falsies. Let it dry a little. And then for my foundation, a lot of people ask me what foundation do I use. I use the NARS and this one is in color medium too. Okay, let me brush my baby. Okay, so I just have to brush my baby really quick. But um, he's laying down now. And he has his little DD in his mouth. So I'm gonna go ahead and rush it because if he starts crying, I am gonna have to cut it again and I don't want to do that. I wanna just finish it quick. Now we're just gonna go ahead and blend. And I'm gonna go ahead and start with my contour. You guys hear my baby, he's about to start crying. So I'm gonna go ahead and just brush it. But we're gonna go ahead and start with the contour. Instead of using baking powder, I am going to use my Neutrogena powder and the reason why I use this is because um, I feel, I don't know, I think I just don't know how to use the um, baking powder because I tried different brands and every time I put it on, it kind of makes my makeup crack. So I don't know if I'm not applying enough, maybe I just gotta apply some more or I don't know, I don't know what I do wrong. But I don't like it, so I prefer to use powder, I mean this powder. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do with my palette, we're going to grab the highlight right here. And what I'm going to do is go right under my eyebrow, right here. Now it's 
done, I'm gonna go ahead and blend it with my finger. And we're gonna go ahead and blend with my finger again. There you go, so that's that. Now we're gonna go ahead and, I was gonna do it with the brush, but I don't like it with the brush. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab my finger and use the same highlight. And we're gonna go ahead and tap it in the corner of my eye. Like so. But I was recording, but it wasn't. So I grabbed a little bit of black and purplish, and I'm just applying it under my eyeballs. And now I'm gonna go ahead and grab my mascara, and I barely have any eyelashes, so we're gonna go ahead and try to add some mascara on it. So I'm gonna be using my Chloe and Becca palette for my contour, and I'm gonna be using this brush. So I'm just gonna like tap it a bit and just trace it and bring it up. Okay, now we're gonna go in with this brush and I'm gonna go in with my Revlon um, blush. This one right here and I'm just gonna use for that one. I'm gonna use this brush right here. And try to blend both of them in. Um, try to go in circles so make sure you blend your highlight, I mean your blush with your contour line just so that there's not like two different lines like a brown one and a blush one. What I'm also gonna do is grab my finger, get some um, blush. Mm -hmm. Like that. And now we're gonna go in with some lip gloss. And now we're gonna go ahead and do the white eyeliner. My waterline is no dry. I mean, my mascara is no dry. Okay, there you go. Okay, now um, that I put my blush on, we're gonna go ahead and go in with a different brush. Actually, I'm gonna use the same one, the one I apply my blush with. And I'm gonna go in with my Chloe and Becca blush and some highlight to mix both of them, okay? So do this, do this, and let's for that to be done and pretty much you guys we are completely done um i'm gonna put on some lipstick on we're gonna go ahead and use this one right here so that is gonna be my lipstick and now i'm gonna go ahead and grab my brush Okay, so this is what it looks like, and I actually like it. This is my first time trying to do my I, blah, blah, blah. I never done my makeup this way. I always do like cut crease and stuff, but I never tried doing like a little dark, smoky. I don't know. I think this is kind of like smoky eye. I, I don't know if that's what it is. So, um, I don't know what it's called, but I love it. And I just want to say thank you to Louie for doing the little tutorial because that was that's what I was following. By the way, you guys, the contacts are from TTT Eye Contacts. And if you guys want to go buy some, you guys can use my code LOLLY15 for some money off. And let me tell you guys, these are really beautiful. And they're actually really comfortable. Um, at first, you know, there I seen a couple bad reviews on it. But you guys, I don't know what those people were doing with the contacts. Maybe they weren't applying them good. Maybe they just weren't taking care of them. But they actually, I actually love them. I don't feel like it bothers my eye. Um, it's pretty good, you know, I've been doing my makeup this whole time and my eyeballs are not red at all um, I feel comfortable with them. I think they are super pretty and they are really nice, you know But yeah, if you guys want to go ahead and buy some you guys can use my 
you guys can use my code lolly15 for some money off okay guys so this is it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope you guys like the makeup look and i hope you guys can recreate it hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe and thank you for the new subscribers for my old ones i love you guys so much all of you guys thank you for supporting my little channel and for just subscribing and watching my videos i hope you guys like this video enjoyed it give it a thumbs up subscribe let me know what you guys think in the comments down below uh, let me know what you guys think about my makeup look, what you guys think about the contact, blah, blah, blah. I love you guys so, so much. I will see you guys on my next video. Bye.